My name is Aya Laurel Uwai Folk. I'm on the communications team. During the summer, I've been writing, live tweeting, editing, and reading a lot. One of the things that I am finishing up on right now is a fact sheet on Karen Dolan's project, which is the criminalization of poverty. I hope to gain confidence in um, public policy, um, more specifically what the work I've been doing on the comms team, so writing for uh, more public audiences, um, and something that's really interested me for a while now is how to craft a narrative that makes sense to people who don't necessarily um, struggle through policy briefings or get really excited um, about that kind of thing and um, but are still interested and curious and energized by what's going on. This was an opportunity for me to connect the community organizing that I was doing on campus and in the, in the city um, with a more policy analysis and policy focused um, approach to many of the same issues of um, inequality, racial justice, economic justice, and that kind of thing. So um, just this past weekend I was in Buffalo, New York for the New Economy Coalition's um, conference called Common Bound. I was first introduced to the idea of what they call a solidarity economy through on-campus organizing as a student, um, but this was my first time being able to really actively engage with it and um, meet with hundreds of other folks who are working in the kind of in the new economy field. And I wouldn't have been able to go without IPS support. It's the folks that um, work in this office and uh, who are specifically involved in um, managing and putting together the Next Leaders program uh, really care about the people in the program and I can tell that it isn't just for cheap labor or back-end uh, supportive work um, but it's really an investment in a future generation of people who are smart and informed and prepared and there's so many different pieces of the of the program that is solely meant to kind of foster the potential of the interns